I know it's cold, but are you courageous enough to step into uncharted territory, beating on your crab day and night? I need you to disappear for the next 30 days. What does that look like? 720 hours dedicated to the future! Where focus goes, energy flows. The problem is you put too much energy into Netflix. You put too much energy into distractions. You put too much energy into entertainment. You put too much energy into things that are not feeding your purpose and destiny. Can you walk away from everything? Life has knocked you to the ground. You have survived the greatest traumas of your life. How tired are you of where you are right now? How bad do you want to get to that next level? What are you willing to do? What are you willing to sacrifice? What are you willing to give up? Who are you willing to let go to get where it is that you want to be? See, everybody wants to be successful. Everybody wants to climb mountains. Everybody wants to be praised and celebrated. But nobody wants to sacrifice. Nobody wants to put in the work. Nobody wants to let go of every single distraction. Can you learn how to say no to what's hurting you? No to what's stopping you. No to the people that don't believe in you. The fakes and the phonies and the people that keep saying that they'll support you when you get there, but they leave you when you arrive. Why are you here? And what are you going to do about it? Because the truth of the matter is, we have a purpose, we have a destiny, we have fulfillment, we've got connections to make, we've got people to meet, we've got rooms to walk in, we've got tables to sit at, and I'm just wondering if you are willing, if you are courageous enough, if you have the faith, if you're bold enough to sit down for 30 days and write down what it is that's killing you. Can you walk away from everything for 30 days? Just one month? 720 hours. Imagine who you could be in 30 days. You got one life to live. Rain, sleep, or snow. The time is now. I got three words for you. Shut it down. Log out of the social media. Get off the internet unplug and evaluate where you are and where you're supposed to be. And I know you're broken and I know you're tired and I know you're weary and I know you're confused and, and I know that you've got questions and I know you're fractured and I know you're bleeding in places nobody can see. But if you shut it down, you can heal. You're standing at the precipice, the edge of the greatest move in your life. And, and, and the time is now like never before to take a leap of faith. It takes faith to jump off of the edge. It takes faith to step into your purpose. It takes faith to step into your destiny. It takes faith to pull away from everything that is familiar, to step into uncharted territory, to become the person you were born to be. It takes faith. Can you disappear for 30 days? The first person that needs to be influenced in your life is you. It's you. You can't lead anybody. You can't go anywhere unless you have awakened yourself on the inside to follow a specific plan. Write it out. I need you to disappear. Life has knocked you to the ground. There are people that have tried to bury you alive and you survive. Are you bold enough? Are you radical enough in your hunger and your thirst to go after what it is that you believe is yours? Are you crazy enough? Are you courageous enough to disappear for 30 days? Come back and shock the world! Can you suffer now that you live the rest of your life a champion? Here's the reality. You will always be where you are until you acknowledge the leeches in your life. 
It is time for you to navigate through the conversation, comb through your contacts. There are people that are taking from you everything, taking your time, taking your energy, taking your thought life, reprogramming and reconditioning you to do something that you have not been destined to do. And the time is now to get tied to people that are gonna help to position you and lock you in a place where you can fulfill purpose and destiny for 30 days, 720 hours. Imagine if you began to write down the people that have not fed into your purpose, the people that have not fed into your destiny, the people that have lied in your face, the fakes, the phonies, the frauds. Can you identify what has kept you broken? What has kept you broke? What has kept you defeated? What has kept you covered under the blankets of anxiety and stress and overwhelm? Your DNA has been mutated by people that are beneath you and it's nothing wrong with having people in your life that you serve, that you love. But you're trying to make business moves with people that don't think like you. They don't walk like you. They don't sacrifice like you. They're not willing to put in the blood, the sweat, the tears behind closed doors. A man is rewarded in public for what he does in private. Think over the things you've discussed with people. Go through the process. Go through the mud. Run in the rain. Dance in the snow, inhale, exhale. I know it's cold on the other side, but it's time for you to cross over because you're too comfortable. Disappear for 30 days, come back and shock the world. Who you are today has gotten you as far as you're going to get. If you're going to get any further, you gotta reinvent yourself. And if you're going to reinvent yourself, you've got to shut it down for 30 days. You still keep trying to walk into your future fractured, broken, hurting. You need to walk into your future whole, conditioned, ready to grab the people that believed in you before you made it to the top. Go back and get them. But first, you've got to condition yourself. You're fractured. You're broken. You're under anxiety and depression. And you've even been borderline suicidal at times. You've lost loved ones. Come on. Who am I talking to? I'm talking to that person that's tired of where they are and you are bold enough you are crazy enough you are courageous enough to shut it down for 30 days you've talked about it enough you've talked to your haters about it you've talked to your supporters about it you've posted about it you've shared about it you've written about it now it's time to put the work in disappear for 30 days